Hey guys, Catherine here. So in this video, I'm going to be going over the Microlite Sleep and Go Cut. Um, I'm going to be going over the pros, the cons, and then I'm going to be putting it together and then taking it apart so you guys can see it from start to finish. Okay, so today I'm going to give you guys just a quick rundown of the Microlite Sleep and Go Cot. Um, kind of some pros and cons, how it works. Okay, so the Microlite Sleep and Go Cot um, is weighs around 15 pounds um, and it's, it's fairly lightweight. Like it's really easy for you to just throw over your shoulder, walk around, lug it into your car, whatever you need it to. To do. Um, it fits really nicely in the bag, um, which has kind of got some like uh, protective extra like thick fabric. It's not like just thin, um, kind of like some of the Graco um, pack and plays are. Anyway, let's take it out of the bag and um, see what it looks like when it's open. So this retails for uh, $1.99, um, which is definitely um, competitive with all the other um, lighter pack and plays. Okay, so what you're going to want to do when you take it out of the box is you're going to want to just pop this part. This main part just has two hinges in the center. You just pop that out, let the legs drop. And they just click and snap together. Really simple. Um, one, a couple pros that I really like about this, just as I'm putting it together, is it doesn't look like a baby pack and play. It's stylish, it's modern. It's a beautiful charcoal gray color. I believe it's the only color that it comes in. Um, and it's just really nice. Um, really quality like it's almost got like a flecked color on top and then what you just do is you just kind of pull these down it's got little velcro so you can kind of just cover up those little tabs um, so that they're not able to be seen and this is the um, the cot for the top or like the bassinet um, it has um, like rod boning in it kind of like um to add support so it's not just a piece of fabric that's holding your baby <laughs> um and then what you do is you just take and you find this zipper and i'm just going to put that here line it up and you just zip it all the way around super seamless super easy and then this also has a nice little Velcro piece um, to cover that up. And all of this, it's got nice breathable mesh air. So then this is your mattress pad for the upper bassinet and then also your lower. So your bassinet, it's just gonna go like this. It does have these little tabs that you can hook in so it doesn't, have any um, sort of movement whatsoever. Um, so this, honestly, we used a lot. Um, we used it in our main living room, probably till our daughter was about two months old. We used it um, to have a place to change her, a place to lay her. Um, we would have toys in here with her. Um, I'd have a little basket um, to carry all of her diapers and wipes and things, have them really accessible um, to the main part of the living. Um, but as she's gotten older, um, we found that this goes great downstairs in our um, lower level. Um, and so then we're able to have this kind of like hub zone downstairs as well. And it's a really, it's a nice firm, but it is like a soft. Um, mattress not super soft but it's safe for them to sleep and she loved this she liked to be able to be up and you know kind of looking around so um after you your child grows up then what do you do right you take this out so just unvelcro it 
I've got to take out the mattress first. Set that aside. And you just unzip. Nice and easy. I just roll this up. Put this right into my bag. Then this mattress just goes straight on the floor. And it folds completely out. So a couple pros as I'm talking about this and setting it up um, in this function. Um, the bottom is a outdoor safe fabric. So you can actually take this outside, let them play and be safe in an enclosed space outside. It's um, nice, it's wipeable, you can clean it off. Same as this mattress, you can really just wipe off. It's not a plastic material, and I wouldn't say it's like a PUL or a TPU, but it's definitely safe for accidents. Um, so then when it's in this function, you can actually, there's a zipper here. Um, I've seen this function on a few other um, carry cots, but, and it just unzips, so they can kind of like come in and out and play. Um, our daughter's seven months old right now, and she hasn't quite figured out crawling yet, so she hasn't really had a need to crawl out, but um, yes. Um, now, uh, one con that I do have about this, um, this particular um, unit is when I'm going to take it all apart, put it back in the bag, <sighs> bless my soul, I just, I, I sometimes cannot remember if it's been a while. I can't remember how to put it properly back in the bag for it to fit perfectly back in there. It's not that it's super hard. I would say it's not as hard as like the Graco. It's not as hard as some of the other ones that I've done. But uh, you know, like the pieces are pretty, um, I mean, I'm gonna start folding up now, but um, the pieces are pretty geometric, I would say, like pretty squared off. So it's, it's not that difficult. There's only a few ways you can put it in the bag. So eventually I figure it out, but that's the one con that I would say um, for this particular unit. Um, but other than that, I really love it. My husband's main point that he likes it is that it is a baby product that looks nice in your house. It doesn't generally look like a baby product. So I'm gonna fold it up for you real quick. As I'm folding it up, I'm gonna show you um, how to fold it up, but then also um, these are some lovely little um, graphic details that they've chose to put on here just to kind of show you where to put your fingers in order to collapse the unit, which I think is very helpful, but when you're looking at it, it kind of just looks like, oh, that's just part of, you know, their branding and stuff, which I really like. I appreciate the little details um, and like the quality and thought that came into making this product. So let me just fold it up for you guys. And just 
just like that, it's ready to go. So I hope you guys liked my review on the Microlite Sleep and Go Cot. Um, it is a product that I haven't seen a lot of stuff on, so um, when making this video, I thought it would maybe help others making a decision or someone who came across this brand, like what it's all about and how it works. Um, so hopefully it was helpful, and if you have any questions um, about this product, just leave a comment below, um, and don't forget to subscribe.